Hello and welcome to 11 o'clock news from Bahrain International. I'm Sarah Bel Fatih. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa and His Royal Highness Crown Prince Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Prime Minister Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa attended at Trafal Palace today the wedding of the grandson of His Royal Highness Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa, His Highness Sheikh Khalifa bin Rashid Al Khalifa. The wedding was attended by a number of their Royal Highnesses, members of the Royal Family and senior guests. His Majesty the King congratulated His Royal Highness Prime Minister and the Under Secretary of the Ministry of Interior for Nationality, Passport and Residence Affairs is Highness Sheikh Rashid bin Khalifa Al Khalifa and Sheikh Khalifa bin Rashid Al Khalifa on the occasion, wishing His Highness Sheikh Khalifa a happy marital life. His Royal Highness the Prime Minister expressed thanks and appreciation to His Majesty the King for his good wishes, wishing him abundant health and happiness.
Israel Highness the Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa received today at Rafa Palace a number of the royal family members who congratulated His Royal Highness for the occasion of his grandson's wedding, Sheikh Khalifa bin Rashid Al Khalifa, wishing him a happy married life. His Royal Highness the Prime Minister also received the GCC delegations who came to express their congratulations. He received the UAE delegation led by UAE's Deputy Prime Minister and Interior Minister, His Highness Lieutenant General Sheikh Saif bin Zayed Al Nahyan. Minister of Culture, Youth and Social Development, Sheikh Nahyan bin Barak Al Nahyan. He also received the Kuwaiti delegation led by Sheikh Daij Fahd Al Sabah and Sheikh Mishal Al Sabah. His Royal Highness expressed thanks and appreciation to the delegations for their kind sentiments, which reflects the deep rooted ties among the GCC countries.
His Royal Highness the Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa received at Qadibiya Palace today as Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Prime Minister Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa. The Royal Highnesses praised the noble goals of the UNESCO King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa Prize for the use of information and communication technologies in education that aim to developing the quality of education, congratulating the 8th edition of the awards winners. The Royal Highnesses reviewed the latest regional and international development and stress the importance of Gulf cooperation with economically vibrant countries which will aid in strengthening and developing the economy of the region. They affirmed that, that uh, exchanged visits between the Kingdom's senior officials and their counterparts in other countries will pave the way for more effective cooperation and strengthen the ability to deal with global economic developments. His Royal Highness the Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa in the presence of His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Prime Minister Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa headed the weekly cabinet session today at Qadabiya Palace. His Royal Highness informed the cabinet about his visit to Qatar after the invitation of Prince Hamad bin Khalifa Al Thani where he will meet the Emir of Qatar, Sheikh Tamim bin Hamad Al Thani. The cabinet hailed the deep-rooted historic relations between Bahrain and Qatar, stressing the importance of the visit in enhancing Bahrain Qatari cooperation and the exchange of points of view in topics of mutual concern and regional developments. His Royal Highness also briefed the cabinet on His Royal Highness the Crown Prince's official visit to Kuwait, commending the brotherly relations between the two countries and the development of their cooperation. The cabinet stated that such visits enhance the march of the Gulf Cooperation Council countries and their role in improving coordination in facing regional challenges. His Royal Highness noted the significance of national initiatives and enhancing the agricultural sector, urging to continue encouraging creating exhibitions that promote national agricultural products and encourage investment in the agricultural sector. His Royal Highness then praised the role of Bahrain International Garden Show under the patronage of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa, which was inaugurated by Her Royal Highness, the wife of His Majesty the King and President of the Supreme Council for Women, Princess Abika bint Ibrahim Al Khalifa. 
The Cabinet reviewed a draft proposal to exempt certain development projects from customs fees, which was prepared in light of the Financial and Economic Cooperation Committee of the GCC. The Cabinet reviewed the recommendations of the Ministerial Committee for Urbanization and Infrastructure regarding the amendment of Article 20 of Municipalities Law 35 of 2001 concerning the review of mechanisms and procedures of services to ensure the proper implementation of government projects and programs. A memorandum submitted by the Ministry of Justice and Islamic Affairs regarding the amendment of the Financial Disclosure Laws regulations was also approved. A draft resolution was approved by the Cabinet outlining the fees categories for licenses and customs fees issued by the Customs Affairs. The Cabinet also reviewed a draft memorandum of understanding between the ministries and bodies of Awqaf and Islamic Affairs of the GCC. The request of the Ministry of Works, Municipalities, Affairs and urban planning to expropriate the path of the AB pipeline between the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia and Bahrain was approved. And finally, the cabinet approved a memorandum of understanding in the field of civil service between the Kingdom and the Republic of Turkey. The Minister of Finance was commissioned to sign the MOU on behalf of the government of Bahrain. His Royal Highness the Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa received a cable from Her Royal Highness, wife of His Majesty the King and President of the Supreme Council for Women, Princess Abika bin Ibrahim Al Khalifa, expressing appreciation to His Royal Highness's statement during the Cabinet meeting regarding the importance of developing the agricultural sector, which come under the directives of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa and is one of the most important activities in organizing of the 2017. Bahrain International Garden Show. The Garden Show comes under the aim of supporting the sector on the local and international levels. She highlighted the bah that Bahrain has always focused on developing the agricultural sector thanks to the late Sheikh Isa bin Salman Al Khalifa. She praised His Royal Highness's efforts in improving the sector and his keenness to provide the facilities needed to achieve further progress in order to enhance the economic march of the kingdom. His Royal Highness the Prime Minister Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa will leave for Doha tomorrow on a broadly visit to the state of Qatar at the invitation of the Father Emir Hassan Al Hamad bin Khalifa Al Thani. His Royal Highness the Prime Minister will meet the Qatari Emir Hassan Sheikh Tamim bin Hamad Al Thani and a number of senior state officials with whom he will hold talks on ways to bolster relations between the two broadly countries. And His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, the Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Premier Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa will conduct an official visit to the state of Kuwait on Tuesday. The visit, which includes bilateral meetings with the Kuwaiti leadership, will focus on ways to advance the existing strong and long-standing bilateral relations to achieve shared goals of development and prosperity. <laughs>